Hello Power Users, Bignan Fukowski here and in today's episode we will be looking at how to add, delete or view specific uh, security roles that you have and how to view the security roles uh, in general and you will be able to add, remove or edit the security roles you have if you have of course the privileges that allow to or you just can view the, your security roles which you have. So stay tuned, it's Bignan Fukowski in and let's start. Okay, so we are on the Power Platform on, the, on my environment. As you can see, this is a default environment. What you need to do is to click in the Scoggy Wheel icon. Then you will go to the Advanced Settings. This will open an old designer mode. So this is not very pretty, but it's fu fully functional. In Settings, you will go to the Security. In Security, you have uh, two things which will interest you in case of uh, security roles, probably. One is, uh, uh, one is security roles, where you can see existing security roles. And let's click on the one and see how what privileges the, they have. So those are privileges of the security role. Of course, the full circle means that the privilege is enab enabled and the, the empty circle means that this is disabled, so this is uh, easy as it is. Remember to uh, this may uh, may be a problem because members privilege inheritance uh, should be on the direct to user, or you may have a different results. Uh, so if you want to know more about this, then I will probably have another uh, video about this. Okay, so this is a basic security role. Then let's go to the security and let's go to the users. And in the user section, you have views. Here you see the views which you have. So we can have read-only access users, enabled users, full access users, etc. Here, here I have my uh, my my administration user. I can click on my user and then. As you can see, you can have manage roles, and here I see my roles. So if you don't have administration privileges, probably this will be disabled. So you will just have the read uh, read only view, probably. Okay, but I I can have uh, I don't have read only view. I can I have full access, so I can change this this instances I can add or remove my security role. Please do not remove your system administration role if you are on the test environment and you are the only administrator it may produce a, a really um, a really baffling topic to, to come by so you know just don't do it. Okay so I think this is it this was a quick tutorial how to view it and Speaking of Koski out, if you like the content, you can view, subscribe, like, etc. I have many other videos about Power Platform, Power Apps, Power Automate, Desktop, Power Automate, Problems and Solutions. See you!